Now, uh, Haskell is also a language that's supposed to let you get a lot done with very little code, right? And it lets you have all kinds of uh, fun functional programming kind of, uh, I don't want to say tricks, but like, you know, first of all, it automatically handers, handles massive scalability, right? Like it has its own software and transactional memory and some other micro-threading kind of shit. So performance, no problem, right? So now it's up to you. How do you break down your website into the input forms of stuff you want to kind of capture, right? The customer's name and address and all that shit. And then the items in their shopping cart, like if you think about, like, say, Amazon, right? And then... um you know, the prices, and then, you know, you do the math on how much the, whatever, and then the shipping and all that shit. So it's all doable, right? And this is free software. It's tremendously fast. It's a language that apparently gets, lets you program uh, a much higher level. So you're doing a lot less code to get a lot of shit done. And it includes its own in-memory database, which is insane because... Now your entire app can run just in Hapstack. You don't need MySQL, you don't need Postgres, you don't need, you know, God help you, fucking Microsoft or Oracle horse shit. And you're running all this on FreeBSD or NetBSD or whatever, uh, Artix Linux or Arch Linux, and then you're ready to go. You know, you put, I don't even know if you'd need Varnish Cache in front of it or HA Proxy to kind of like do the load balancing, but you have like instant scalability. It's only limited by the hardware. And your programming ability. And it's just fucking, it's free, it's